right, yeah, 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 y'all. It's your boy, Tro Pesci, man. Now watching Be Shine. Definitely the South Bronx. You know, um, I had to be uh, probably like eight years old in the South Bronx, man. I heard the um, Chief Rocker record. You know what I'm saying? I was with an older cat at the time, family member. And um, they were spinning, you know what I mean? They was cutting the vinyl up. I was a shorty. I ain't never seen it done live, you know what I mean? I fell in love with it right there. I scratched the record. They was freestyling, you know what I'm saying? It was definitely historical, man, at that point in time. I always listened to it, but that point in time was the it was when it clicked. Yo, this is what I want to do, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, that's, that's, that, that was some shit right there. Man, nah, man, I fell in love like the first time I seen it, man. You know what I mean? Uncle Uncle Ralph, you know what I mean? Video Music Box, you know what I mean? Rap City, Top 10, used to tape it on VHS. You know what I'm saying? Freestyling over everybody else's instrumentals and shit, you know what I mean? You know, it was it was that South Bronx moment, man, when I when it really clicked right there, hit me in the heart. I was like, yo, this is what I want to do. So that was the big impact, you know what I mean? Ever since that, I dabbled with it, I had fun with it. And as I, you know grew older and, uh, you know, basically on the feedback that the people heard from from my music, you know what I mean, is is that, you know, that that, that kind of motivated me to take it serious instead of you using it as a hobby, you know what I'm saying? I was doing all the open mics, you know what I mean? At that time, I was out in Staten Island, you know what I mean? We threw, we threw like three different uh, open mics in Staten Island, you know what I mean? You might see me at the Pyramid, EO Dub which is one of the classic, you know what I mean, open mic, Sunday night, longest, running in a minute, you know what I'm saying? And besides that, just working on my craft and, and really songwriting, because I was known for freestyling back then, you know what I'm saying? Everything was off of the top, just venom, you know what I mean? Just fire upon fire, and then that slowed down, and, you know, somebody told me how to write bars, not 42 fucking bars, you know what I mean? 16 bar verses and hooks. And I started writing songs and taking it more serious that way and just, just trying to perfect my craft, man, and burning CDs. Went from homemade CDs to writing, you know, Tro Pesci. I was actually named Killer Call back then. And, um, you know what I mean? Handing out, you know, homemade CDs to later progressing and doing mixtapes, you know what I mean? And then even more progress, doing albums, you know what I mean? Worldwide albums overseas, shout to Stroke. Real in the field, we did that in France. You know what I mean? I'm working on my other one. Shout out to Kayo, we doing another one in France. And um, and my man, uh, Adverso, man, we doing something in Greece too. So, came a long way, man. It's been a long time coming, you know what I'm saying? They was cool, they was cool, you know what I mean? They probably just, you know, for the most part, thought it was just some bullshit, little hobby, little fun, you know what I mean? Which at first it was, you know what I mean? And then, but they backed it up, man. My pops was out there slinging mixtapes, you know what I mean, in the streets to his people, to people that, <clears throat> to my people that bumped into him in the streets. He was out there slinging. My mom, too, my mom's working in Manhattan and she's selling them in the office, you know what I mean? So my fam been behind me since day one. I'm blessed, man, I'm blessed. Shout out to my parents, man, I love y'all, real talk, man. Besides the feeling I get from the fans and the, and, and, and the screams and the shouts and the roars on stage, I would say um, landing my first album deal with, with my man Stroke in France, real in the field, you know what I mean? I did that all on my own, you know what I mean? I used to promo online since the MySpace days, heavy, heavy, you know what I mean? And, um, you know, I landed that deal myself, you know what I mean? Me and him worked it out and we came from the ground up and we put out vinyl and we put out, you know, worldwide distribution and all that, that was a big deal, you know what I mean? And, that's, and, and, and it's like that small to me on a real scale right now because I got four projects that I'm working on. So it's just a stepping stone, man. It's just a stepping stone, you know what I'm saying? What does it allow me to do? It allow me to live, pay bills, you know what I mean? I ain't gotta wake up at six in the fucking morning and go get my blood, sweat, and tears to somebody else who's probably sitting on their ass and their couch making money off me, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm able to eat off my talents, which is a blessing, you know what I mean? Because this music, music business is funny and we don't all make it, you know what I mean? We some of the nicest people in New York City, man. And we here, Lit Lounge, Underground, It's Alive, shout out to Shabam Sadiq, you know what I'm saying? And um, you know what I mean? I get in where I fit in though, you know what I mean? I don't, I don't, I don't bully, I don't, I don't beg. You wanna fuck with me, I fuck with you, you talented, I'm talented, let's get it, let's move on the same road with the same gas tank, and let's get it, you know what I mean? I hope I'm spoke about, you know, in, in your top 10, or your top five, whether it's top five, 10 rappers, MCs, lyricists, New York City rappers, whatever you want, class of me, I, I want, when I'm dead and gone, 
I want my name to live. I want my music to live. I make timeless music. I'm an 80s baby. You know what I'm saying? I came up from the boom bap era. So that's what I make. Fuck age, fuck what's in, fuck what's cool, fuck what's not. You know what I mean? I'm a square nowadays. My pants is baggy. You know what I mean? My hoodie's baggy. I rock low all day. You know what I'm saying? I'm the outcast nowadays, and I'm good with that. Because I'm going to be me, Troll Pesci. You know what I'm saying? And that's it, man. I'm going to just keep doing me. If you fuck with me, salute. I love each and every one of y'all. If you don't, that's your opinion. I respect that, too. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to just keep moving, man. I got a lot of, a lot of music on store, on standby for y'all. It's going to get hectic. But that's about it, man. You know what I'm saying? It's hip-hop, man. Keep that shit alive, baby.